These strangely uplifting photos show a postman dutifully doing his rounds in a Santa Rosa neighborhood left in charred ruins by a devastating wildfire. Large swaths of the city were wiped out amid the deadliest series of wildfires seen in California, which has claimed at least 31 lives and destroyed 3,500 homes. How likely is Donald Trump impeachment aerial photographer Douglas Thrawn was capturing drone footage in the Coffee Park neighborhood of Santa Rosa when he caught the surreal sight? Set against the backdrop of a street completely flattened by a fast-moving inferno, the U.S. Postal Service worker appears to be oblivious to the destruction. Undeterred by the ashen rubble, the postman was seen delivering parcels to half a dozen homes. To view this video please enable JavaScript, and consider upgrading to a web browser that supports HTML5 video It was a trippy thing, he was actually delivering the mail, Thrawn told the Mercury News. I was shocked to see him because most of the roads were blocked off, but he obviously had access. Couple filmed their terrifying escape from hellscape inferno I've covered wildfires and floods before and I've never seen anything like it. I'd see areas that were totally fine, but then get to Fountain Grove and the Hilton and see them wiped out. It was unbelievable. USPS district manager in San Francisco, Noemi Luna, said it showed the long-standing relationship between postmen and their customers. The carrier in question was honoring a request by a few customers who were being let back in the fire zone to retrieve personal items, she said. A few customers asked the carrier to leave their mail if the mailbox was still standing because they could not get to the annex to retrieve it. Since the fires ignited on Sunday in spots across eight counties, the fires have transformed neighborhoods into wastelands. At least 3,500 homes and businesses have been destroyed and an estimated 25,000 people forced to flee. Someone brought a dog on a plane and people loved it. The cause of the fires is still being investigated, but evidence points to fallen power lines in Sonoma County. Sonoma County Sheriff Robert Giordano said officials were still investigating hundreds of reports of missing people. We have found bodies almost completely intact, and we have found bodies that were nothing more than ash and bones, the sheriff said. Some remains have been identified using medical devices uncovered in the scorched heaps that were once homes. Metal implants, such as artificial hips, have ID numbers that helped put names to victims, he said. Distinctive tattoos have helped identify some. More Amazon Studios chief Roy Price suspended after TV producer Issa Hackett accuses him of sexual harassment. More Labor MP reveals sexual assault by pub boss who undid her belt while she was asleep.